has made it very clear that under whatever circumstances, we should keep our, keep our heads high. Keep our heads high. Refuse to be told that this is Nigeria, meaning this is a place where nothing works. We should refuse to agree that this is a country where certificates are forged and it is okay. We should refuse to accept a situation where elections are rigged and you are told to go to court. These things have consequence. These things have consequence. Jesus says you shall know the truth and the truth will make you free. You can run a nation well if we do not respect the truth. If we keep pretending that we can play games, cut corners, bring in brilliant lawyers to turn black to white and white to black, the reality will still be there. And when right now we are still in the midst of the election. And it is not about the politicians or the candidates. It's about us, about Nigerians. It is we who went to vote. And if we do not have good election, you can't have a government that enjoys our confidence and our trust. Even angels cannot rule a nation where there is no trust. So whoever claims to be ruling us now should know that we need to have the trust of the people. The question before us is how do we manage that the people may have trust in their government. A lot has to be done by those who claim to be ruling us, those who say we have elected them. They cannot just sit there and expect that just things will work normally. What will they do? I don't know. But if they ask my suggestion, I will say they should, re they will, they should accept the reality on ground accept that they have a heavy trust deficit and nothing wrong with admitting that things when it didn't go so well when i hear professor mahmoud on television even yesterday telling us that everything went perfectly well in january i shed tears he knows he was not telling the truth if we don't tell the truth we will not move forward I'm a religious person and I keep praying to God to forgive us and to show us the truth. Because we can, if we tell the truth, things will move fast. Nigerians are wonderful. And I still hope that things will move fast. Whatever judges may decide, whatever courts may say, at the end of the day, the truth will make us free. Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to this Facebook page and YouTube channel. I mean, as you know, they can help me share this video, make me talk small. Guys, now see this man when he talks, so wait to be this man here again. He yaki in can something like that. By your own, no can no fear. In the other DSS, may they go and raise this man for the good and for the truth with this man talk. Like, I don't get it. By your own, no. No. When I feel tell us, say, wait till this man talk, now lie talk. Every two this man talk, the man hits me for the head. But I meant if you people when you tell enter Nigeria, wait till they happen. Not be one problem to another with a face for the country. The country they go where? No. The country is not going where. The, see, I tell now before I say, when you still wait till not belongs to you, you don't go feel that you do anything for anyway. That wait till the world ball I meant if you need today. The man that will ball I meant if you need to see, that ain't no make and feel work for that country today. Because the man that belongs to someone else, it not belongs to Bola Ahmed if And the person will be saying, Come give Bola Ahmed if the man that Malu Yakubu. You see, all of them, they go face the road for body one after the other. Nigeria today, they mess. Now, Malu Yakubu Kosa. Nigeria today, not the work where Now, Bola Ahmed if Tinibu Kosa. You see them, now they Kosa. So, this man speaking the truth, he said, Yes. We the quick they move on. Nigeria, we are quick in moving on. The only one who quick move on be say Nigeria not believe on this government. That's why we move on. That's the that's it. Nigeria not believe on this government. We Nigerians, 
will not believe on this government. I wish that government will say we believe on. Believe me, you. We for the help this government. All of them. We for the work and the heart to make sure see yes, eh, the country better. Anything they break up, we need to like. Bola met if you anything talk, not the get head. That's why you see Nigeria just I be more leave this government. Maybe they go, but we need to fight. We don't need to leave them. The reason why we know we move on, be seen. We need to fight to get the country, but we need to take out more for their hand. That's it. Because this set of people, if you give, if we give their chance, believe me, you, the chance is where they will take it. It will to go high. Tomorrow, we they expect? We won't see what the Supreme Court won't talk tomorrow. We won't see what they won't do tomorrow. Because tomorrow, we'll get a hearing tomorrow for Supreme Court. We don't see and say people will just that for the case. It gets one video when they pick up for her again. Because any Peter will be article and one woman like that again. Because any Supreme Court matter tomorrow. When I see it's the war. But inside this matter, so Nigeria must stand. And we need to come out to the speak the truth. If other bishop like this will come outside to the talk, the way all these ones they talk. So when I feel see where we did today, and then we go there. But I don't know those one will be say the what's it with that pastor the way they call that Elijah they call, I don't know. We come and say, I could talk with you. No, no. You see, then Abola met if you be the first person where they use false certificate in the roof of a country like Nigeria. What a shame. If a pastor can say that in the pulpit, but then believe me, you that pastor is a fake pastor. No, no, pastor. That one are just survivors for a long time. Did you hear me? If a pastor can come out in his church and say, Bola met if Tinibu is not the first select president who have ruled Nigeria with a forged certificate, then. That pastor need to hide him face in shame. And the same thing changed for Nigeria. You hear me? So those kind of people now they support Bati for the country. And we, we stand here to say no to fake document. No to arm robber. No to money launderers. All those things for the country. We don't need them in power anymore. Because this Western world will do this. So if you don't anything make you don't do small thing, you can't they say you're all called rough or anything, my brother. You know they go anywhere. You know they go anywhere. No talk or say they come your see for one big crime. You know if you say they want they want elect for supermarket governorship, they don't carry you. No talk or say you're called a rural full country. Just the way Bola met if you need do so. So we need to fight to get it back. Me, I won't see the DSS. We won't carry you two legs. Go this small house. Say now so they can go pick them up. Because APC not like who you they hit the nail for the head. They don't like what you they tell them the truth. According to one post what I see, they say the most dumbest and senseless people in Nigeria are APC supporters. Truth to God. They don't get brain. Before they enter APC, you want to get brain for inside, they open their brain, take her, come up, we all come back. They end the thing, they the reason. APC supporters. Before they enter Bola Met if they book camp, they did knock their head. Because they don't know the thing where. Because they are dumb, they are mumu, they are so stupid. So like, those people, they, are, they don't get sense at all. APC. So imagine somebody like this man now. They talk truth. Talk at the country be. Talk with the app for the country. Sweet the people they go through. Any Anything somebody just talk for the country. They are not the past. Go and get him arrested. Arrest him. This boy, I don't look away busy in the time of election. Where this man use this thing. Boy, I don't look away. What did this man do for election time? Nobody come outside to talk to him. They arrest by a no Nobody arrests this man with all the atrocity where this man commit for that election time. All of the instigate the fight when the app for Lagos, where they say made the Igbos come on. Buy Onuga was among them. How many arrests don't give you by Onuga? How many people don't order for your arrest? No, nobody don't order for your arrest. But now go quick because you know now they talk now. Go and raise this one, go and raise this one. See, everybody go talk for Nigeria now. Me, I go see if I go fear arrest everybody. Then if I arrest everybody, me, I want to see the people who don't want government for that country. Because Nigeria, no doctor, Nigeria to my personal business. Nobody feel speak. Nobody feel talk through again for the country. Because, you know, now the cabals will support the country. Nigeria, as I tell now, we need to speak. Because on our face, the end of the year, the year round. We need to they speak to condemn all these their evil acts within that country. Bola Ahmed if Tinibu is not our president, then no. If you see they keep attacking you, they know see they hit the truth because they tell they say Bola Ahmed if Tinibu never win. Like this man said, 
But I make the king people know we the best way they there, not the rule way. The best way they there, they make the country. That is it. Either with the stolen mandates. Tell me how you want a function with the stolen mandate. You can't. Let me wait the app for Nigeria today. Stolen mandates cannot make the country work. The only they promise, promise. Now I promise they will they promise, 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 but they cannot work. They cannot do anything. The country will do one place. Now I'm be waiting to happen to Nigeria today. But let's see what will happen if the Supreme Court will do the right thing and give us our money to make the country stand again. Peter Obi, like we said, is our president and we vote for. With Peter Obi, new Nigeria is possible. That's how I go end this video here. Please help me to share this video. Buy an onuga. Will they wait for your arrest? Why arrest him? Then you will know if this man get family or not. Nonsense, people. Please help me to share this video as you do so. God bless you. See you guys in my next video. Stay safe, guys, and bye bye.